on today's episode of How Badly Can She Screw Up Her Own Motorcycle? Not really. So here are my tools. Some brake cleaner, some brake lubricant, some new pads, EBC sensor pads gonna help improve my braking power. Torque wrench that I just got for Christmas. Thank you! And then 12 meter uh, socket, 4 millimeter Allen. Let's get her done. All right, so here's the first one I took off. Now, um, you don't have to remove your ABS if you don't want to. Uh, it has a little strap you could just pull off. Um, I don't see any need to remove it, so I did not. My little ABS line. So, my dear friend Jessica did remind me that, you know, you don't have to take off the caliper if you don't want to. Uh, you just remove the pins in the top, and you should be able to just slide them in and out. But, while that technically is true, it does look like a bit of a hassle. And not only that, I can't... Uh, clean the dirt and grime on my pistons there so we opted not to do that and then I'm going to show a comparison between these stock pads and the new center pads from EBA, EBC okay hold on all right those are what the stock pads are going to look like very filthy got my fingers nice and dirty and the new ones are going to put in so hopefully these do work better. Looks like I had 4.3 millimeters left on these pads. I have about almost 8,000 miles on this bike now. And let's see what this new one is. So the new one's gonna have 5.1 millimeters, give or take. All right, so I cleaned the calipers to my satisfaction and after cleaning them, I depressed the uh, pistons in to make the application of the new pads a little bit easier. Alright, there's the clean brake, new brake pads and cleaned everything up with some brake cleaner. I got the pin back through the holes. It's really simple to do. There's a lot of people out there who show you uh, how to do it step by step just is just showing you that you know average Jane like myself can do this um, and make an upgrade to uh, your braking power on your bikes what do you think Sally would you trust braking this bike now hmm? here's the little collar cotter pins getting ready to get pushed back in